Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Sharnice and welcome to Simply Niqua. Today, in this video, I'm going to unbox for you guys another one of these Love Books box subscription boxes. Can I say a box again? So if you want to see all what's inside this lovely big box, sit back and relax and continue watching. But before you do, how about go down below and give me a like, please? Subtitle throughout this video, and as well, go down below and subscribe while you're down there as well. Why not? But other than that, let's get started with this video. So first before I unbox this box right here, first I want to say I love this subscription box for beloved books. It's amazing. I love all the goodies inside. I always think it's worth the money. So let me tell you all about it if you don't know about it. So if you go to lovebooks.com, you can go and check out the website and they have all kinds of good things. But if you want this subscription box, this big one right here is $60. There's also a subscription box mini box that is $20 and you get uh, some of the things and some of the books that comes within this one. But this is the main big one that gets you everything and is $60 with change for shipping and all that. So, if you want one for yourself, the subscription is not every month, it's every three months. So this one's for March, and then the next one will be in June. I always like getting these boxes to give myself a little treat, especially since I love books. So let's unbox this box. So the theme for this box is Love in Bloom, since it's spring and since it's March. Love it, and I'm excited to see what's inside. <laughs> First up, we have some postcards. I really love all these designs on them. And it seems like these designs, you can actually color them yourself before you mail them to somebody. And I really like the aspect. Next up is a pen. I really adore this pen a lot. It's a nice like flower pen. It's really soft and I like the writing of it, like the ink of the pen. I love the little flower on top. It's just good for spring. Next up is these little candies. I think this called Saint Ange. I think these on the back of it says it's from France. So let's give these little candies a try. So you open up these candies and they look like this. Cute little pink little candies. Now let's try them. Smells good. I can't really describe the taste, but it's not really that bad and it's really good type of little candy. I give these candies like 8 out of 10. Um, yeah, I think these are really good and I like how it's from France. It's somewhere different than America. So yeah, I really like these little candies. Next up, we have a little small baggie and let's see what's inside. First, we have a pen of a book. I love these pens that they give in these boxes. I usually put them on my backpack. I love this one. Blue, feeling behind my eyes. Next up is a, a bookmark. I like how on the back of the bookmark it's kind of like that old like library kind of bookmark. Mm, my intentions, I... As well, I really like these stickers. We got April, May stickers and June stickers and these are all so so cute. Next up we have this flower, nice flower pouch um, and I think it's a pouch for your books because like look here's a book and you're gonna put it in, in there. Fits nicely with a closed thing like this and it closes and it's nice like little pouch for your book and I really like this and I really love the design I love the flower design it's so pretty and it's so soft and uh, definitely a great idea next up we have a box that says press flowers so um yes <laughs> So the 
the materials in this box allows us to press flowers. I always wanted to do so a press flower, but I never had never done it. So now that I have this, that I'm able to do it, and I'm so excited to press some flowers this summer or spring. And now I can't imagine me with anybody else as we close out the night underneath the lilac sky. Summer high, met you in August, New York, back to my cold apartment. Distance sucks, but at least I'm still with you. White out sky. Next up, I got some color pencils. I fight to wherever I don't mind. And a adult coloring book from Meredith Wild based off of the Bridge series of hers. And I am so happy for this. I'm excited to start coloring some of these pages. Each page has its own character and its own like style. And I really like this. And I love all the quotes that they picked out for this book. And I can't wait to start coloring this. This is a wonderful, wonderful, great idea. More authors should do this for their book series. Like, this is really cool. The next thing that was in this box was this gray scarf, I'm assuming. This is really, really cute, and I really adore it. Like, look at this. It has a nice, nice little fringe at the bottom, and I love the, like, the little design in it. Like, look at that for that March wind, y'all. Like, this is so, so cute. And to the finale and the main event of this unboxing, the books. With these big boxes, there's usually three books. But for this box, we get four books. So let's find out which books that we got. First, we have a book called Delight, Inc., and it's by Carrie Ann Ryan. And first off, I love, love the cover, and I love that flower design. Here's what the back of the book looks like. And you can pause the screen here and read the back of the book. This book sounds really, really good, and I can't wait to read this one. The next book we got is, is called Paradise Found by Marcy Butler. And I, I like this cover as well. You could pause the screen to read the back of the book. And, and this one sounds really intriguing. And I can't wait to read it. Like, I can't wait to read all these books. And I'm glad to have new books from new authors that I haven't read from. And it's really exciting to get new books. <laughs> The next book is from Helen Harnett, and this was called Melt. This is from their Still Brothers uh, kind of collection, and this is number four as well. Pa I pause the screen to read the back of the book, but yeah, this one sounds really good, really, really good too. Once again, I can't wait to read this. <laughs> and the last book that I can't wait to read <laughs> is a hardback book. Yay, I always love a hardback book. And it's called Misadventures of a Version. And it's by Meredith Wild, one of my favorite authors. As well, you can pause the screen to read the back of the book, see what's all about. But once again, it sounds lovely. Four brand new lovely books. I'm so excited to read them all. Which book should I read first? So you guys, thank you so much for watching this unboxing of this Love Books box subscription box. I always love to get these and show you guys what's all inside because this is a cool subscription, especially if you like books. So thank you so much for watching this video. If you like this video, give me a like down below. Don't forget to subscribe as well. But other than that, thank you so much for watching. And I'll catch you back next week with another awesome video. I promise y'all. Bye.